Hey guys, so again welcome to the session and in this session we are going to see the analysis and the market forecast for Euro USD. So uh, if we try to find out the recent level guys uh, before we were thinking and we were planning that the Euro USD will move downwards from this level. So exactly we were uh, right the Euro USD. Uh, went towards in downward direction from this label right so that was a correct analysis now from here we can expect only a few corrections uh, till uh, till here but what market did the market exactly came to the previous high and still we can see if we see that very carefully then we will see that it has just broken the high of the previous market and after that we got a red bearish candle here which can, we can say that uh, this could be a fake move by the market to hit our stop losses above this label and market again came inside the uh, uh, the previous zone or the previous assistance level so this uh, this is a process to move the all sellers uh, from this uh, level and after that the market can go in uh, good bearish direction so as i can see in the coming week the market for usd uh, should be strong so that is why uh, also reason the euro usd has a good possibility to move in downward direction so this is one reason that we are uh, here on a good resistance level this is one reason i am sharing my views on euro usd and remain will depend on the market so uh, i can see that there are multiple uh, resistance level for uh, euro usd and the, recently the market is uh, uh, on the strong resistance here so that is why uh, this these are indicating that the market should go in downward so uh, from here if we'll see uh, if we'll see this level so this was a uh, last support in euro usd and this support has also got broken here right so this is also indication so from here we got a good bearish candle and here is a one indication again we got that yes there could be a good uh, pressure of the seller that is why market came inside this label right so this is one another reason this is a second reason and this is uh, then uh, if we say the where should we plan uh, for entries then i uh, what i will say that uh, let the market come inside uh, in this label and after that uh, check again one bearish candle if the market uh, get as a retracement then enter for your sell entries right so this is a safest entry for UUSD what you need to do is just you need to wait for a retracement one more time then you can enter in EUUSD so I will say just wait for the retracement and uh, uh, draw a paddle line on uh, m30 or m15 time frame chart and just check for the breakout then you can enter for euro usd with a very small stop loss right guys so uh, this is one thing uh, if we go on a daily time frame chart then what we can see in daily time frame chart let me show you as you can see uh, this was a uh, zone here for euro usd right check here this was a zone here and the market got strong rejection exactly from the zone right so this is really strong zone right this is strong zone and uh, as you can see market how much the pressure uh, euro usd got from this strong uh, selling label and market just uh, touched this level and it got closed here so this is a uh, big pressure by the seller this is also indicating that yes the seller can uh, take control to the market and it can uh, take more in more for the downward direction guys these are my views on euro usd we will see what the market do i will be in bearish for the euro usd and uh, remain will depend on the market please follow the money management and uh, you have also uh, need to follow the risk management as well so guys uh, if you're first time on my channel please like share and subscribe to the channel for more updates live videos and if you have any queries any question please uh, uh, comment in the chat box i will reply your questions and queries guys thank you so much